Hi folks, Christian Brindle here, and today I'm going to be bringing you our fourth edition of our series where we review Medicare supplement insurance companies and kind of show you what they have to offer. Today we're going to be reviewing Aetna Senior Supplemental Insurance Company, which as many of you know is now part of the CVS Health Family Organization. Um, my name is Christian Brindle. I'm a licensed insurance agent, which doesn't mean anything to anybody because there's a lot of those out there um, that really, you know, don't know much. But I've published three books on the topic of insurance, two about Medicare specifically. I host the ever popular The Everything Medicare podcast, which is um, now is the most popular in Medicare-based podcast on the internet today. And um, I own a company called Christian Brindle Insurance Services, where we work with people on Medicare in 10 states. We'll get to that in a little bit. So what makes Aetna Senior Supplemental special? Well, as many of you know, in 2019, they were acquired by CVS Insurance Company. Now, Aetna Health and Senior used to be a company called Continental Life. Now, they still do business under the Continental Life name in some areas. But that being said, um, Aetna came in years ago and actually purchased Continental Life Insurance Company. So Aetna Senior is actually a, a subsidiary to the actual Aetna company, which actually does group insurance, Medicare Advantage plans, and things like that. So Aetna Senior is basically what used to be Continental Life Insurance Company, now both of them under the CVS Health umbrella. Um, CVS being a, a very large company, a very um, influential and um, important company in the healthcare industry, um, and them being under the same umbrella kind of helps Aetna have that backing and good direction as CVS um, has been known to be a very good company in how they run things. Now, like many companies, as you might have noticed, you know, with our Mutual of Omaha video and our Cigna video, we mentioned something similar. They have multiple companies they do business with in different states. So in each state, you might notice that Aetna Health and Life might be available, which is one of their subsidiary companies that does Medicare supplements. But in another area, it might be under the Continental Life name, and so on and so forth. So they have multiple different companies in different states that they use um, in order to offer new products um, when another product becomes inflated as far as prices are concerned. It's a strategy that many, many Medicare supplement companies offer. Um, so that's why if you are living in, let's say, Utah, where I am at, you'll see the Aetna Health and Life company. But in some other states, it might be Continental Life or something else. Typically, in most markets, their competitive rates make them very, very attractive. Now, you normally with Medicare supplements, what you want to watch out for is a lot of times companies that have very low rates starting out typically aren't able to sustain it and the prices go through the roof. A lot of times you'll see you know, very small companies that can't keep rates low offer the lowest rates. We call them bomb, bottom feeders in the industry. But Aetna is a little different than that. They have a low rate increase average. Typically, they're about 5% or under average over the course of a 5 to 10 year period. Um, doesn't mean they can't be more in any given year, but they've had a very good history with rate increases um, amongst the best in the industry. So these, of course, are all the Medicare supplement plans available on the market today. Um, as many of you know, Medicare supplement plans are created by the government, which means they're standardized. The benefits, meaning, are actually decided on by the government, and then these plans are actually given to private insurance companies to market. That means that every single insurance com company that offers Medicare supplements all offer the same plans. The main thing that makes them different is the insurance companies all can decide what price they want to charge for that plan, and also what the rate increases will be going forward. So... To give you an example, a Plan G on this chart, which is probably the most popular Medicare supplement in the market today, and you might be able to see why if you look at um, the chart here, it covers everything that Medicare leaves behind, with the exception of what's known as the Medicare Part B deductible. As I talk to you about this now, that Medicare Part B deductible is $198 one time a year. It's a one time a year annual deductible. After that deductible is met, it is full coverage for the rest of the year. As long as Medicare pays first for something, the supplement will pay afterward. Um, plan, the most popular plans today are probably plans G and N. We just talked about G, but N is a nice alternative that a lot of times is a lower premium than G, but it does come with more out-of-pocket. It also charges the Medicare Part B deductible. It also does not cover Medicare Part B excess charges, which depending on where you live, it could be more of a concern than another place. And it also charges two copays. It charges an up to $20 copay 
to see a primary care doctor or a doctor of any kind. Um, and it charges a $50 emergency room copay to go to the ER. Medicare Part Plans C and F, of course, were grandfathered in due to the macro bill that passed in 2015 and took effect January 1st of 2020. Basically, in a nutshell, what that means is if you become eligible for Medicare after January 1st of 2020, you are no longer able to purchase a plan C or F. However, if you were eligible for Medicare before January 1st of 2020, you will still be, have the option of picking up one of those two plans if you so chose to. Um, but even before those plans were grandfathered out, G and N were more popular because they were so much less in monthly premiums compared to the F, and they were so similar, it just didn't make a whole lot of sense to pay $30, $40, $50, 60 more a month for an F when the coverage is so close with a G or an N. These are the states that my company, Christian Brindle Insurance Services, can offer you Aetna Medicare Supplement products if they are in the state. Utah, Idaho, Colorado, Washington, California, Virginia, Oregon, Texas, and Florida. Those are our 10 states. We're always adding more. Call today, folks. My name is Christian Brindle. I'm a Medicare health plan expert and specialist. We partner with all of the largest insurance companies in the industry, including Aetna, Aetna Senior, um, amongst many other companies as well. And we can shop your market and find out what the best available fit is going to be for you for your Medicare supplement plan, Medicare Advantage plan, or any other type of Medicare health plan that you might be dealing with. Our office number is 801-255-5340. 801-255-5340. Um, what do I think of Aetna Senior? Well, I think Aetna Senior is a very good company. Um, we've had great results with them for our, with, with our organization. We like the low rates. We like the low rate increases. You can't get much better than that in most cases. Thanks for watching this video, everybody. If you like these kind of videos, please let us know by dropping a comment in the comment section, liking the video, and subscribe for future Medicare content we bring you every single week. Thanks for watching.